Hello friends, this is Ashwani Bhatia. Today I am going to tell you how to use a get method in PHP using MySQL or how to fetch a data in MySQL using get method. But there are two kinds of methods PHP. First is post and second is get. Post will take the value from the form and get will take the value from the URL or get will send the value from the form to URL. So what we will do today, we are going to create a project that contains uh, some products and some items. So what we will do, we are going to uh, fetch some products from the database using get method and we will uh, use a get method in the URL to take the data from the URL. So uh, what we do first, we are going to create a database using a PHP and use, we will going to create a table. So what we will do, say fetch data. Now what we will do, first we are going to create a container. Now add some table. I will take the variable name as TGC. Now I will take username. <laughs> what is my host name? My host name is localhost. Now, what I will do? I am going to create a page that is known as connect. I will say mysql underscore connect. Before connecting the page, first of all, I will require the config.php. PHP. Now, what I will do here, I will type the host name. Here, I will type username. I will type password. Now, MySQL underscore select underscore DB. What is my database? Service name is DB. Now, this is my connection. Now, I create a table using PHP in MySQL. So I say table. So this page contains the structure of the table, what are the methods, what are the systems, what are the what are the <coughs> So what I will do? I say require. Now I will require connect HP. Now MySQL underscore query. I'll say create table supposed to be I say plus ID in dealer auto underscore increment its primary key. Now I will say ID I have created now say name. I will use varcap. Now, what I am going to create the next table. I will copy this. The next table contains first ID. I will use the cost item ID. Now, this is my name of the my products items. Now, I have to create one more ID. 
I make as following key. I say F O R I R E I G N foreign key. Which column I'm going to make a foreign key? ID. Which table it is references? References. What's the name of the table? Products. No, I will call it, give the name of the column as. Now you can see once I will learn this page. This page. I say scratch it. Table. You can see clicking on the you can see it two variables will be created. Now must create table products ID auto increment primary key name data care. Okay, create table products ID item increment auto increment primary key. Dash page. Dash page. No table three. Now connect the PHP is there. Config the PHP is there. The database name is there. Connection is there. Now I have to require a connector PHP once the connection is there. Now what are the problems here? Table products ID integer auto increment primary key name var create all products ID auto increment primary key name var care. Sorry, I haven't used a comma here. So foreign key references works now I will run this page you can see no table is created sometimes this refresh so what I will go to databases I will check TGC you can see I don't have any table in this create table product either auto increment primary key name variable character VARC Okay, that's fine. I haven't closed this column. Okay, let's take which I've done here also. So, what I will do, I'll refresh the page. You can see in structure. Now, products are created. It's ID and name. Now, then this square, I don't need this ID again. Now, create table. This is the column which this finished and this and this creatable products. Products now I have the negative name as no. You can see this column is created. Item. So what I will do now, I am going to be insert some data inside it. So now going to products, say insert. I have two products, first is laptops and second is mobiles. You can see now, two tables, two rows are inserted, laptops and mobiles. Now I will add some items. Supposed to be, I will add Samsung Grand. It's a <coughs> of 2. It's a product of 2. I am going to add some keys here. Say mobiles. Say 2. Okay. Now Lenovo. Lenovo XYZ. Okay. 1. Now you can see it's added successfully. Now again insert. Now I will do Sun Duos. What I will do? Duos Galaxy. It's two. 
now what I will do I will say Sony wire and series 15 to 5 it's 1 now you can see I have inserted the data successfully inside the items inside the products now in the next tutorial I will do I will fetch the data using a GAT thanks for watching our tutorial have a nice day